will get. But Krav Maga as a system is designed for short-term training. The assumption built into Krav Maga is that people won't have time to become career martial artists. You can actually master the basis of Krav Maga and certainly get the approach and the attitude in eight to 12 weeks, uh, assuming you're training a couple times a week. Now, to understand more technique and to get into higher level and higher risk training, you have to be with it longer. But you'll learn the basics against the average street attack in a few months. It takes you from zero to 60 faster than any other system I've ever seen. Or you could put it this way, that it brings you to a high level of proficiency quickly. That's what Krav Maga does. Headlock from behind, specifically a bar arm. The headlock comes on from behind. If I had time, I would tuck my chin early. Even before the headlock came on, if I realized he was here, relax your hands, if I realized the attack was coming, I would tuck my chin. I'm gonna assume right now that I don't have that time. I'm totally surprised, and this happens to me. From here, my hands are gonna wanna go where they feel pain. I make my hands like hooks, I pluck explosively. I reach as far back as I can. Not right to here, farther, so I get momentum, and I pluck. I reach for both his hands, because this is where there's an opening. There's no help for me here. This is where he's the weakest. Both hands go like hooks, as far back as I can, and I pluck down. When you're training for a mixed martial arts fight, it's a totally different paradigm. You're training against somebody you know, you know how much he weighs, you know how much he's supposed to weigh. <laughs> you, you, know, you know what his style is, what his experience is, you've watched a video of him probably, and you get to prepare. You have two to three months to prepare for that fight. It's different, you, you get to work on a certain set of skills. You know the day and the time of your fight. If you know the day and the time of your fight, you can prepare for it. Krav Maga takes a different approach. You might not be attacked tomorrow, it might be a year from now, it might be two from now. It might be the day after you learn how to defend yourself. It might be a year after you stop training. The approach for Krav Maga is overall preparedness against any kind of attack. In a mixed martial arts fight, it's stand up, it's ground fighting. There are rules. On the street, there are no rules. Go, 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 being shoved, pushed, punched, kicked, grabbed when you're not expecting it. Um, this is an example of one type of drill that we'll do in Krav Maga. My real goal is, and I've said this for years, that I've wanted a Krav Maga membership to be as common as a health club membership. I want people, I want it to be a standard to be, for the average person to be training in Krav Maga as, as common as is now here. People say they're, they're a member of, of a gym.